Hey, welcome back to Home Reviews. In this video, we're taking a look at this Intelligent Humidity Dehumidifier by Zilino. So if you've got too much moisture in your air, this is something that you would want to have to pull more of it out. And so what I'm going to do is put a link below this video. So if you want to go check this out, you can or even pick it up yourself. But let's go ahead and unbox this and see what it looks like. All right, so this is what we got. Very well packaged. You have styrofoam. It was covered in plastic. You can see it's even got protectors over top of this front panel here. And then you have your user manual. And you also have uh, this card here. And it says here, register to gain Zolino exclusive services such as lifetime warranty projects. You want to make sure you check out this card and also the user manual before you jump into this. But I'm going to go ahead and uh, take everything off of this. I'm going to plug it up and then we're going to see how this works. Okay, so I was looking in the box for the power cord and didn't see it, but where I found it at is if you turn this around, you're going to see this little compartment here, and this is actually the area that um, the moisture gets drawn into that you'll have to empty, but you can pull this out, and it's got a little lid on here, which makes it very convenient too for you just to pull it out and dump it out once it's full. And then here is your charger. So I'll go ahead and put this lid back on it. And then we're going to put it back in here. And I'm going to go ahead and get this plugged up so we can get a better look at it. All right, we got it plugged up, but I wanted to show you guys here too some of the uses that you could use this for if you have too much moisture in your air. So maybe in your bathroom, and this is a common area where when you take showers, especially hot showers, a lot of moisture gets in the air. Also bedrooms, travel campers, after bathing to keep your bathroom dry. Maybe the basement's wet for a long time, needs dried. And also it says for the moisture of the animal and plant environment, it's necessary to maintain a certain humidity environment. So there's all different types of reasons you could use this. But to get started with it, all you'd have to do is hold on, put, push on the power button here. All right, so we got it powered on here. Now there's a couple things I want to mention that I noticed is that if you look at these icons on the screen, they will not match up with the icons in the book. So you have one called time uh, button. You can see it looks like a clock. Well, on the screen, it's actually an H. And then over here, their mode button, um, you're not gonna see that up there. And also the ambient light button is this one here. So the way this works is, let's say underneath here, you can see the purple light. And if you want a different color light, all you have to do is click this and it shows you different colored lights. Now they also have an H up here. So if you want to set this one a timer, you can just hit this H button and then it sets up for so many hours. So eight hours, 12, 24, 36, or 48 hours, or even 60, uh, you can go clear up to there. Next is your fan speed. So if you tap this one, that's level two, and there's three, and you can probably actually hear that one. So it is taking all that moisture from the air, sucking it in, and putting it in that little compartment back here. So you want to make sure, depending on how much moisture you have in the air, you want to keep an eye on your little compartment back here, because once it gets full, you will want to empty that. Do not let that overfill. And then the other thing you have here is your humidity level which you can set from 40%, and I believe it goes all the way up to 95%. So I don't know why you'd want that much humidity in your air. Um, normally, you know, 40, 45 uh, is probably just fine. And then that's all there is to it, and you just let it set, and you let it run on its own, and it's going to continually to draw the moisture out of the air for you. And then when you're done using it, you're just going to hold down the power button, turns it off, unplug it, and you can box it back up and put it away, or you can just continue using it depending on your situation. So that's all there is for this one, but this is the Intelligent Humidity Dehumidifier. If you guys wanna check it out, get more details, read more reviews, uh, maybe I missed over some of the features. You can find all of that through the link below this video. So that's it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it, please subscribe to my channel, and I will see you on the next one.